repeated this fact to her refinement. Choosing a high perch, she belts out her song across the Wildout Forest. Move the battery. Okay. Move the battery. She looks somewhat scruffy. During the breeding season, her normally glossy black head feathers fall out and her head turns orange. But she can certainly draw in the males. None of the males know who is the father of her chicks. But as she's made with them all, all bring her food in answer to her call. <coughs> so she gave all of them a kind of deeper, they all brought her food. Yeah. Yeah, man, okay. they all got to be, they all got to be, they brought her food. Nice, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let you be. Thank you, baby. Finally, she returns to feed her chicks. Having gathered food with very little effort on her own part, and everything to make them feel a little tired. Trees are full of large insects, cicada, recently have female insects. As they feed, they spread out quality. And for the villa forest wind always on the lookout for something new to eat, there's a feast. Amazing. This is some good footage. Good footage. I hate it. Cicadas are a valuable source of protein, but it's a lot of effort. It's a child hawk, the size of a small bird. She is a specialist in capturing cicadas. She is skin by it, analyzes it, and drags it to her underground cage. are nothing if not opportunistic. It's an adaptability that sees them through the worst of the southern dry season. Five, over five minutes already. Eventually, these rivers will fill. A brief wetsuit. She's not squeezing enough. It's February, 
Come on, bro. That's a pink outfit, bro. It's the monsoon season in Mandan, and heavy rainstorms rule down the island for the north. Thunder clouds begin to bubble up. At last, after ten months of dryness, a deluge hits the Beargarden forest of the west. And that shit don't want to die, you serious? This is some great footage. Let me back up a little bit. Put a shade on my shit. I'm gonna win. As soon as he's laid her eggs, she'll die, and all the males will be dead soon after. Their lives are lived only in the brief dead sleep. The plants with their short lives hasten to the end. Living fast and dying young is a radical strategy to replace where resources are low for most of the Suffocated, yeah. Hmm. There goes the infamous Kenya C. 
understand, but we're turning upside down. That's what they do. Sometimes they turn around upside down. I'm getting some great footage, you know. Well, that's my annery, two times hat annery, Kenyan Samboa, female. She just wallowed a pinky live. I usually don't feed my animals live, but unfortunately, these new additions to my collection, they only tend to eat live. So, frozen thawed, I tried, just no go. Seems like these Samboas like live, they prefer live. Cool.